Judge, that is long gone. Oh my! All right, everyone, what happens when you throw the ball right down the middle? Right, I mean, right down the chute. A lot of damage, usually, I would think, but let's do some research here. So, what we're going to do here, some people have asked me, you know, I'm into the baseball analytics and the stat cast and all the information that's out there. I dig it. Um, so some of you have asked, you know, how do, how do I get that information? Where do I get it? How do I go through the StatCast database and, you know, find some of those answers? So I'm going to just walk you through one right here. And this video basically is what happens when you throw the ball right down the middle? Who throws the ball right down the middle? Um, let's just take, take a look. So what, what we'll do here is we'll go to, uh, you go to Baseball Savant, you go through the StatCast search uh, up there, and then what you do is you got all these different categories it's a little bit overwhelming at first. Uh, I've learned most of it just by trial and error. You got pitch type up here, fastballs. You can isolate by a certain pitch, knuckle, curve. EFIS is even on there. Uh, you can say, okay, I just want to select pitches that are swung and missed at or put in play. Um, or I just want to look at pitches that have been hit for a home run or for a single double or have been hit into a double play. So uh, so you get it. You get the picture. It's it's a, a lot of different stuff that you can uh, you can tweak and look at. So let's look at down the middle, pitches down the middle. And we'll just start with, I want to see which pitchers have thrown the most pitches right down the middle of the plate so far this year. So how we do that is you can go to these game day zones right here. You see it right here, game day zones. And what you do there is you can open up the drop down. You see right in the middle, right there, is five. And that is, that's right down the middle. That is a pitch you do not want as a pitcher. So that's all you have to do for this one. That's it. You got pitches right down the middle. You got all these different uh, categories here. We'll put no minimum there, no minimum results. We'll sort by pitches um, and just click search for 2018. And let's see what we got. Oh, James Paxton. One of the best pitchers in baseball, apparently, though, is throwing the ball right down the middle 119 times. Uh, Danny Duffy. Max Scherzer, look at that. 108. You wouldn't think that. Um, so that's interesting. So we can see which pitchers are throwing the most right down the middle. And you can also sort by, um, sort by batting average so, or slugging percentage. So let's do, slugging, let's do slugging percentage. And for this one, what we'll do is we will take uh, no minimum results for slugging percentage because that can get a little weird when you're dealing with decimals. Um, but minimum pitches, let's say a pitcher who's thrown 1,000 pitches this season. So we want pitchers who have thrown 1,000 pitches this season. Who's been affected the most? by throwing them right down the middle. Luis Castillo, at the top of the list here, when he throws it down the middle, a lot of damage has been done. So he's not getting away with anything. Ian Kennedy not getting away with anything. Michael Fulmer not getting away with anything. Conversely, look at this, Tanner Roark. When he throws the ball down the middle, his slugging percent, and they hit it, slugging percentage or strikeout, is only 273. So that's incredible. Nick Pavetta is getting away with it as well. So that's, you know, you kind of look at it and you're like, oh, are they going to keep getting away with that? Is that going to be a trend that they're always going to be able to throw the ball down the middle and not, not get hit hard? I don't know. So let's take a look and see which batters have done the most damage and least amount of damage with pitches right down the middle. So we'll go minimum pitches, we'll say 750. That seems about, yeah, that seems about right. Um, and we'll go slugging percentage. Pitches right down the middle. Who has done the most damage? Who has done the least amount of damage? Franci uh, Francisco Lindor. Do not throw him pitches right down the middle. He's got the best slugging percentage on those pitches. Uh, and it looks like Gary Sanchez, Bryce Harper. You don't want to throw him there either. Mike Trout. No surprise here. Good hitters like pitches right down the middle. Aaron Judge at 11. But this will be the interesting part. Let's take a look at on down the list. Who does not handle pitches right down the middle? Uh, ooh, look at this. Kettle Marte, Dexter Fowler, Justin Upton. You throw it right down the middle, and he is not handling it. That's interesting. Let's go look over here. You got graphs over here, and you got a bunch of different options of charts. And uh, let's see, spray chart. So here's here's Justin Upton's spray chart on pitches right down the middle that he puts in play, you got a pop out, field out, pop, ground out, ground out, ground out. The singles are here, single, single, but it doesn't look like he has 
He doesn't have a home run. He's all singles. So the only times he's put it into play, it's been a single or an out for Justin Upton. So I think that's interesting. Like, to me, that's very interesting to see that the guys who are getting the pitches right down the middle and what they're doing with them and, and guys who aren't cashing in, like Andrew Benintendi, not cashing in. Adam Duvall, not cashing in. Now, there is a difference between, you know, if it's a fastball down the middle or if it's a curve or a change or something. So let's just isolate. You can do this, too. We'll isolate fastballs. And so we'll isolate all fastballs. There it is right there. So you get four seam, two seam, cut, split finger, sinker. So we'll just see, okay, what batters. So these are just going to isolate just pitches right down the middle that are fastballs. Nothing off speed, nothing breaking, just fastballs and see who is done the most damage against fastballs right down the middle. And the answer is Bryce Harper. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> uh, Ozzie Elbies, Mike Trout, Francisco Lindor. This is like a who's who of good hitters. Ian Desmond struggled this year, but if you throw it right down the middle, a fastball down the middle, he's going to take advantage. Uh, let's go to the bottom of the list here and see who is not handling fastballs down the middle. Andrew Benintendi, Wilson Contreras. Wow. Look at Giancarlo Stanton here. You would not guess that. Fastball down the middle to Giancarlo Stanton. He has, what, a double? Is that his only hit? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We'll do one more here and just say, let's just isolate all the home runs. All the home runs. And we'll just put that back to pitches. We'll see who has home runs, the most home runs on fastballs right down the middle. Estrubal Cabrera. Five home runs on fastballs right down the middle. Aaron Judge, four right down the middle. Uh, the thing is, and the cool thing with this is that if it's got the little video um, icon in the right, that means there's video of it. So let's take a look at it. So here's, here's Aaron Judge. Judge gone. gone. Oh Don't throw Aaron Judge right there. That's a bad idea. Let's see another one for Aaron Judge. Off of Craig Kimbrell. Craig Kimbrell threw it right down the middle. Oops. Bad idea. Even when you throw 97, you shouldn't do that. All right. Let's do one more. We'll do one more, and we'll see which pitchers have gotten the most strikeouts on fastballs right down the middle. So fastballs, pitcher, result is going to be a strikeout or a strikeout double play. Is that the only other strikeout option we have here? Yeah. So strikeout on a fastball right down the middle. Which pitcher has the most? We'll go minimum pitches 500 just to make the search a little bit quicker. Eight, Max Scherzer. Eight pitches right down the middle where he has a strikeout. And one of them, luckily, JT Real Muto, we got some video for it. So let's take a look at it. Here's a strikeout with a fastball right down the middle. Pitch, yeah, I mean, when you throw it that hard, 96, good luck. <laughs> good luck. Uh, and you can do this, too, where you can go up here and you can click this box, and it will only show you the plays that have video. So you got Cole Hamels, Justin Verlander. Let's take a look at one of Justin Verlander's strikeouts of a pitch with a pitch right down the middle. Okay. Verlander says, I'm just going to throw you 2-2, fastball right down the pipe. <laughs> I'm seeing a common trend here, 97 miles an hour. That seems to be difficult to hit no matter where you're throwing it. Yep, right down the middle, doesn't matter. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned something. I did. I learned something by watching this whole thing. Uh, thanks for watching. If you haven't done so already, please subscribe. Give it a like. This is a little bit different video than the ones I've done before. More informative, more how-to. Let me know in the comments if you want me to do more like this. And uh, that's it. Ahmed out.